Hi and welcome to Ideas for Profit. Today we are going to talk about Atul Industries, which is an integrated chemical company historically known for its epoxy adhesive solutions. Firstly, coming to its earnings review, company posted 27% sales growth in the quarter gone by. EBITDA grew by 68%, mainly on account of better pricing and operating leverage. Now coming to the key business highlights from the company, company is a market leader in few of the aromatic compounds which goes into personal care and fragrance and market. Company is also one of the largest manufacturer of uh, VAT and sulfur black dyes which have an application in textile and paper industries. Secondly, company is one of the largest or has a significant market share in few of the compounds which goes into API and crop protection industry. It is particularly known for a pesticide compound indexocarb and uh, pesticide, sorry, herbicide intermediate 2,4 dichlorophenol. Thirdly, company has a strong additional revenue potential because of the capex done over the last few years. In the last four years, it has done a capex of the range of 800 to 900 CR, which leads to an additional revenue potential of around 0.9 times fiscal year 18 sales. Fourthly, company has a strong balance sheet and free cash flow is expected to improve. In fact, it's noteworthy that company has paid back its debt in last fiscal year. Now, as far as outlook for the company is concerned, uh, we continue to expect low double-digit sales growth in medium term, mainly on account of high utilization and better pricing for some of its uh, products. Secondly, we take note of uh, strong operating performance recently and expect that operating margin should sustain around 17% in near term. Thirdly, key risk factor to look at is oil prices, which we expect it to be range bound. As far as stock is concerned, it it trades right now around 22 times for clear 20 estimated earnings, which seems to be an interesting level to look at. So that's all from my side. Thanks for watching.